Hey guys, Gunwald here. Today for my EDC on a budget, I'm going to bring you a Gerber knife. Um, this one is called the Descent 2. What this is, is a, uh, a folding knife, of course. And it has an open frame design. You can see, you can see the blade on this side. And over here, it's, you know, got a, a full frame on it. Um, the, uh, the blade is uh, a modified drop point made out of 7CR17MOV steel. And it is titanium coated. <clears throat> it's uh, 3 inches long. The closed length is four and five eighths inches long, and overall is seven and a half inches long. <laughs> this knife is—it's uh, quite different. It, it has what's called a modified liner lock in it. This right here, long here, is is the lock. You press that in to un unlock the blade. Um, let's see, it does have a dual thumb stud. It has some gripping serrations on the top of the blade right there where the thumb goes. Uh, it does have a very sturdy stainless steel pocket clip, which is a uh, low ride, I guess they call it. It rides deep into the pocket. Um, th it comes with this is this is funky. This clip right here, I guess, so you can clip it onto whatever I don't know, uh, some kind of a strap or you know a D ring or I don't know. But y you pull back this little. It's got a handle here on both sides. I don't know if you can see, there's one there, one there. You pull them both back. Um, which, it does not come back very far. I guess if you put it on a D-ring or something, you wouldn't need it to come back very far. But, uh, yeah, I mean, that's less than half of the distance between the opening there. And it is very loose. It's not, it's not very tight. This thing, in my opinion, this product, for a Gerber product, is crap. Um, I have a couple of other Gerber items. I have a, a paraframe knife, and I also have uh, the shortcut, which is a little multi-tool with a pair of scissors on it. And those are fantastic, you know, knife and multi-tool. Uh, this thing is just, I'm surprised that Gerber would put out something this cheap. Um, it is really funky. It is kind of funky. Uh, it has a funky feel to it. Uh, being that it's only like a half of a frame, this side's open. There's nothing really to, to grip onto. Um, this... Like I said, this clip thing is in there very loosely. It, you hear this? It wiggles around. It it's, doesn't have a very strong spring. It could easily open. Um, the blade, it locks up really well. This, this uh, locking mechanism works really well. It has no blade play up and down. But side to side, it's terrible. There's a lot of blade play in there. I'm, I would assume that it's because there's no frame on this side. And it doesn't have that stability, you know, to hold it in place very well. But, uh, yeah, that's really loose. Um, and, and it's just the, the quality of this thing is just n not very good at all. Um, so I would recommend you guys uh, to stay away from this one. But if, 
for some reason you do want it, I will put a link in the description to the Amazon Marketplace um, where they have these for $13.95. <clears throat> I picked this up from uh, eBay. Uh, it was a bidding um, price that I wanted at, and I got it for $11.50, which, um, in my opinion, it wasn't worth it. It's, like I said, it's just a very poor quality item from Gerber. I'm just, I'm just disappointed in this thing. There's, there's absolutely nothing good about it with, with the exception of, you know, the sharpness of it. it it's got a, a decent, decent uh, blade on it as far as the sharpness goes, but everything else about it is just disappointing from Gerber. Yeah guys, so uh, I would stay away from this thing. Uh, do not recommend this one. But uh, let's see if I can get it to cut for you. It does have a good blade. But that sharp blade is about the only thing about this that uh, is, is good. The only thing. Other than that, it's garbage. There you go. Uh, this is the Gerber Descent 2. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll talk to you later. Goodbye.